So, Drybones, how's it going with Talia so far? Pretty great. She's got low self-esteem, so I don't need to worry about her dumping me for another guy. Plus, she doesn't try taking advantage of my wealth. Probably because you aren't that wealthy. I'm wealthier than you! My dad has two mansions! That's awesome. I wish my family had mansions. Boo! Does it ever occur to you that even though he says he has all these possessions, did you never see any evidence of them existing? No, not really. Have you boys seriously not done any work yet? Now that you mention it, no. We're really sorry, we were just having a discussion on- Don't answer me back, Carl. You three had better pick up the pace, or I shall be having words with your parents. God, I hate that. I don't know, even with Talia, I'd still love to have a word with your mom. Not that, the don't answer me back thing. At least give me a platform to defend myself. Oh well, I'd still love to see your mom. I thought the your mom's hot thing was gonna stop now that you have a girlfriend. Just because I'm with someone doesn't mean I have to stop finding other girls attractive. And it's true. Great, now I actually want to do work. Where's the equipment? I'm gonna go find Talia. Later, scrubs. Oh, pretty good. We were learning about forces, like how things are moved. He pushed over the table to try and demonstrate. What do you mean, becoming? I don't know. I didn't think people could transform into those. Hi guys, how are you three doing? Of course not. In fact, we're going on a trip in my dad's old motorhome this weekend. <laughs> yeah, and we're off to the beach in it too. I feel so sorry for you, Talia. You're just jealous! This motorhome's amazing! It's massive, and it goes really fast! Cool! Can we come? Uh, well, when I say massive, I don't mean there's room for you three. You said there'd be room for the entire cast of Game of Thrones yesterday! Oh, well, um... Uh... Were you perhaps making stuff up? Fine then, come on the trip on Saturday, and then you'll see how wrong you really are. Can you guys please not argue this weekend? I kind of just want to have fun like we originally planned. <sighs> You're right, sugar. Let's go to that cafeteria or something. Later, assholes. Man, I'm so excited. We're going to get to go on a trip in his fancy motorhome. Beep, 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 beep. So, where does this weak bones guy live? The address he gave was 43 Shroom Road. Okay, and one more question. Why'd you bring that plant with you? I want to give him some time out in the open, have fun. My nipples like being out in the open, but you don't see me walking around without a shell. Please don't put that image in my brain. Your mom seems to like that image in her brain. Well, here it is, number 43. I knew it. Hello? Oh, hey Carl and Mr. Mitchell. That's Officer Mitchell to you. Whatever. So this is the mansion. A crappy bungalow at the end of your street? 
No, no, the mansion's on a different street, but one of the supermodels had too much to drink and barfed in the pool. So it's closed for a couple weeks. Hey! Oh no. What are you losers blabbing about out here? My friends have arrived. You mean you actually have friends? That's pretty unbelievable if you ask me. So, uh, you must be his father. Officer Kelvin Mitchell of Toad Town Police. I'm Carl's stepfather. Ready to f say? Piece of sh Dry's friend's stepdad's chief of police. Friends? That skinny sh has no f friends. He just f about with the f in his room. Yeah, did you know this guy has a real life size wiggle plush that he pretends is his best friend? <laughs> no, I don't. Yeah, you do. We've seen you. This is making me really uncomfortable, so I'm gonna go now. Uh, thank God that pig's gone. <laughs> the police. Yeah, you'll be fine here, kid. Unless Dry decides to dress you up as a woman and pretend he has females in his life. <laughs> oh, hey, there's three of Dry Bones. A ghost and a squid? This is the friend group you've attached yourself to? Even for you, that's trash. We'll be inside if you need us. The model home's around the back. And if you do happen to get any female company, which you won't, don't say it's yours. No one will believe you. Hey, that's my dad you're talking about. He has like five boats and 20 cars. Wait, so you haven't told your dad about Telia? Nah, to be honest, we barely talk. I'm usually at the mansion popping bottles while he's at all the top casinos. That's understandable. Can't wait to see the mansion, though. Mansion? That looked like a trashy bungalow to me. Hey, Dry Bones, we're here. Oh, um, hey, Talia. I, uh, wasn't expecting so many of you. Well, you did say there'd be room for everyone, but I'm sure you weren't lying. <laughs> Ah, uh, who's this little guy? Oh, that's my pet piranha plant, Marvin. He's really friendly. What's he drooling at? He has no eyes. They use their strong sense of smell to sense where everything is. He probably smells my new perfume then. Anyways, shall we all go to the motorhome? Here we are. <gasps> this is the motorhome? Oh my god, this is priceless! Ew, there's crumbs all over the floor. This place is a mess. Okay, I never said it was perfect. You guys just had your standards too high. I like it. It's like my bedroom, family room, and kitchen all merged into one place. Um, Dry Bones, where are we gonna sleep? There's only two beds. Some of us could share, if that's not too much of an issue. That's a nice suggestion, but there's only two beds. Wait, where'd your plant go? Help! Aw, oh, crap. Marvin! I told you, no sucking women's blood! Sorry about that. Well, at least things will pick up once we hit the beach, right? Ooh, actually, about that. They're filming a private movie on the beach we plan to go to, so we can't make it there. Are you kidding me? That was the only reason we came. Yeah, now where the hell are we gonna go? Just to this exotic forest. It's been booked by my dad and his team of businessmen just for us. How does that total bullcrap fix your screw-up? Come on, Talia. You know I wouldn't do anything to hurt you. I guess the forest will be fun. We can look at trees and stuff. Alright then, let's hit the road. Alright everybody, we've arrived! Great, we don't care. Aren't we gonna go sit outside or something? No thanks, I'd rather bathe in my own urine than sit out there. Alright, I'm changed. How come no one else has their swimsuit on? Grace, honey, why on earth do you want to swim in the muddy water? Come on everybody, it could be really fun. Yeah, I wanna come. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Come on everybody, it could be fun. Carl? Oh, um, sure, just give me a sec. Dad! Don't sneak up on me while I'm getting changed! I'm your dad, I see everything. 
What are you doing? I'm getting ready to go swimming. Duh, I'm here to make you worry about embarrassing yourself in front of that cute girl and her friends. Well, can you not? For once, I'm not worried. Yeah, you say that now, but you will be when they choose to find some hotter guys to swim with. Face it, Grace is out of your league. Look, you're just gonna make everything worse, so I'm just gonna leave. Fine, embarrass yourself. I'm gonna go complain about modern music or something. W what's wrong? Do I smell? Who were you talking to in there? Um, it was one of those call centers. Oh yeah, I hate those. <laughs> Ugh, I can't believe we're actually going through with this. Yeah, but at least we might meet some hot guys or something. These guys are losers. Yeah, I don't understand what Talia sees in this skeleton. I suppose she just can't do any better, but... Shh, he might hear us. Crap, you're right. We better go before they come in. Oh, I feel so uncomfortable. It looks like a whale. Hardest whale I've ever seen. <laughs> yeah, just make sure he eats and doesn't wander off. He can wander off inside the pot? Cool. I was talking to Marvin about you. Alright, I'll see you guys later then. Oh my god, leave me alone! What's the problem now? Mary Lynn, she won't stop messaging me. Why don't you just break up with her? Quit being an idiot, Flag. She's one of the hottest girls at school. Yeah, what you want is to get with another girl for a couple of hours. Hey, what about those girls down there? Hey, there's Roxanne and her friends. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go get him. Floyd can take the fat one. Hold on. That's Carl and the skeleton. That's what you focused on? Not the girls in swimsuits, but Carl? Shut up, Bob. I've got to show them who's boss. Also, I'm calling dibs on Roxanne. Hey, that's my sister you're talking about. You really think I care about that? Alright, we've been swimming for a while now, so let's play a game. Yeah, cool. I like games. Whatever. Race you to the end over there. Great idea! Alright, but I'm warning you. I took private swimming lessons from an athlete when I was young. Sure you did. Uh... I thought this was the game where you were supposed to go from the bottom to the top of the board. <sighs> <sighs> oh, dry bones. Man, what is he even doing? So, Talia, do you know Jake? That ginger kid? What about him? Oh, nothing. You guys just seem really alike. Um, what's that supposed to mean? Oh, we, uh, noticed you both left comments on the same photo on Koopa Book. That was my picture. And he was asking for directions to Goomburger. Well, we just think you're alike. Just keep him in mind. In mind about what? I'm with the dry bones. Yeah, but come on, the guy's a dick. He lies about everything, including this trip. Yeah, plus he's all bone. Like, how small do you think his- Just shut up. He makes me happy. Sorta. Yeah, guys, stop trying to set Talia up with people you deem not good enough for yourselves. Ah, thanks for waiting for me, assholes! Sweetie, that's not the point of a race. Why were you splashing and flailing in the water? Oh yeah, there was a wasp. It was huge! Wasps won't come to sting you. You're made of bone. Whatever. I would have won if it hadn't come at me. <sighs> come on, let's just start heading back. It's almost five. Alright, girls, you're coming with us. Yeah, bring your friends, sis. We're off to Bob's for beer. Wait, you guys are brother and sister? Well, he just called me sis, so yeah, it is kind of obvious. I know, it's for the idiotic fans who need confirmation on something that's blatantly obvious. Probably you shouldn't have said that out loud. Who cares? You girls are all coming to my place for beer. 
Yeah, Roxanne, you're mine. Oh, and Carl, don't think you're off the hook. Go away, you little brutes. We don't want to hook up with you guys. Hey now, Grace, let's not jump to conclusions. Yeah, stop being moody. Liam here is a farmer. Um, why bring that up? Well, Sam Mitchell, you got something against farmers? No, of course not. I just don't see why you even bring it up when picking up girls. I'll have you know, farmers get way more pussy than you ever will. Carl, shut up. You're making it worse. But I don't hate farmers. Enough. You guys grab the girls. Except the fat one. Hey, don't talk about my girlfriend that way. Oh, yeah? And what are you gonna do about it? Run! They're heading to that motor home. Cooper's gang are here! What did he say? Ah! Phew! That was close. <laughs> Yo, Scrubs, you're not gonna be safe in here forever. Oh no, what are they gonna do? Well, if I know my brother, they're... <laughs> Get out here with your tops off! <laughs> Holy crap! We're trying to barge in! No! I'm so dead! My dad's gonna be furious! Stop whining and just drive us out of here! Alright, fine! Arrgh. You idiot, Flake! They're getting away! To the bikes! It looks like we've lost him. For now. Thank God. Those guys are such animals. Where did all the good boys go? Like us? Sorry we can't all be nerds like you, Blooper. Stop fighting, will you? Look, you're upsetting Talia. Um, guys, we might have a problem. Get out of the motorhome, losers! Not today, grunt! <laughs> More coming, guys! Good job there, Marvin. You know, it's getting kinda late. I'm thinking we should go back and get him another time. Yeah, you're right. We can pick up some fresh meat somewhere else. <gasps> what did he say? Your dad's here. Ah, uh, this damage wasn't me. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> no! This weekend is ruined! My life depending on that thing staying safe! There, there, Tribones. It wasn't all bad. Sorry, I had to pee. Right where I want you. Uh oh. Uh oh, indeed. It's getting dark, so we'll make your beating quick. Then the girls will come back with me. With just you? What are we gonna do all night? Drink on our booze while watching soap operas? Just go away! We don't want to go drinking with you, especially if you're going to beat up our friends. I've had enough of your whining. Now if you girls aren't coming with me, I'll smash your face in. Oh my god, Grace! Try bones, do something. What do you want me to do? Give him a special hug? Gooper, g g get off her. I'm not done with you yet, Mitchell. Just you wait. G g get off her! Make me! Hey, get off my boot, mutt! Oh, um, hey there, officer. Hello there, young man. We were just trying to find the bar, I mean, patrolling the forest, but we heard shouting and thought we should investigate. Um, okay, well, uh... Yeah, we heard someone say they'd smash someone's face in, which can be classed as assault. Oh, well, there's no assault going on here. You are aware you're choke-holding a young girl. <laughs> no, I'm not. Okay, we didn't see any real assault, so we'll let you off the hook. But get the hell out of here. Thanks so much, officer. <laughs> oh my god, are you alright, Grace? I think so. That was really scary, though. Carl? Um, I can explain. Wait, so you and this cop know each other? Yeah, he's my stepfather. That means he's banging his mom. <laughs> Oh man, Talia, what's wrong? My parents are gonna kill me when they see me getting out of the police car. 
I was already in trouble after I got fired from Goomburger. And I haven't even done my exercises today. And on top of that, I got loads of revision to do. Oh, were we supposed to actually do those? Cool, I've just been throwing mine away. Hey, DDD! Wait a second, you're not the guy who delivers the dead gold parts. I want you to give my girlfriend, Talia, her job back. She didn't deserve to be fired. What, you mean fat girl? No way. I replaced her with this hotter girl, and more people are coming to weed in now. Why can't you have both of them working here? Don't really feel like it. Give her back her job or I'll tell everyone you're selling dead gold parts. So, uh, did you hear about KSI and the Sidemen? Hey, Dry Bones, I'm here with your drinks. <laughs> so did I, but I got a call today. I'm rehired. Really? That's awesome! Well, I gotta go now, but we'll meet at the park later. Well, that worked out well. Yeah, I was afraid she'd never get another job. No, not that. This is the exact same cup I had last time. 